happening everyone god bless you all another latest and greatest from the religion of peace even during ramadan nothing satisfies these islamists and while the media is so busy with this solidarity solidarity bull crap with this palestine and israel issue and it shows the evilness of the world and the stupidity of the liberaches you know, I got to use different words so everything's not offensive to them, you know. The Liberace's still being blindsided, defending some of these Islamists and what the Hamas people did. But what this is what happens if you allow people one step foot in, an extra foot in, into your territory, to your land. Even if they're not the, not the majority, they just need enough numbers, maybe what, 15 to 30 percent to start a havoc and it's sad in the situation in India even with them being a majority Hindu and with the country being separated there's never peace in this land you know everybody wants to blame other countries but they don't like to take in their own responsibility and even with these Islamists inside they don't care they'll come after you so, Muslims execute two Hindu children, slitting their throats with the razor. In a country where Muslims are living better than the Muslims in Pakistan. Even so, maybe in Bangladesh. As it says, we always provide Quranic verses. Surah 47.4 matches with it. When you meet the unbelievers, strike the necks. And then when you read further on, their way of bringing repentance is they'll threaten you. You better leave the religion. Then yeah, uh, I'll show some mercy to you. That's how Islam is spread. This de religion is so demon to the point they have to do what Allah tells them or Allah will punish them. And this kind of sick behavior... It is reported on the authority of Saab Ajatama that the Prophet of Allah, when asked about the women and children of the polytheists being unalive during the night raid, said they are from them. Who cares? You see other um, contradictions. Oh, don't take out the women and children. Unless it's depending with their own people. But polytheists, for Muslims, they can apply that to anyone. Even in their mindset, they think that Christians are polytheists. So yeah, why not? Slit their throats. You people need to wake up. Of all the faith group, this is a problem. And to you moderate Muslims that still staying quiet, how long are you going to just sit there and not do nothing about it? When are you going to challenge your faith? When are you going to ask your imams like I did? And you'll realize the more you ask the tough questions, you'll see the imams, how they'll treat you. Stop being afraid. Stop being afraid to ask questions. This is the lie that Islam promotes. That you're not allowed to ask questions. You're not allowed to use logic. I will keep hammering this until they all wake up. If you get pissy about it. And I know many Muslims you do. That's fine. Good. Let that anger filter in. Maybe you'll do your homework more. And start looking into it. If you're serious about the faith. If you're just one of those, I'm just a Muslim by family, but I'm still, I still don't like people talking about me. That's not going to solve every, anything. You expect people to stay silent about it? This is coming from OP India News on March 20th. On March 19, 2024, in Badwan district of Uttar Pradesh, two minor Hindu children have been murdered by accused Sajid excuse me, <clears throat> accused Sajid after slitting their throats. A third child also suffered severe injuries on the neck. He is currently being treated at the hospital. Sajid was accompanied by his brother Javed, who is on the run. Disgusting, disgusting Islamists, especially in that part of the world. You got, you. got Many of these Islamists so brainwashed, even some of my family members. I'm pretty sure some of it coming in these different usernames don't want to defend it. The stuff that they lie to you, the stuff they tell you about the Christian religion, and every disregard, I know where I stand, you know. I know I, I disagree with a lot of Hindu religion, but in the Christianity world, we don't just go around attacking people. You conversate. 
If they don't agree, you move on. You pray about it, and God will deal with their hearts. Member of the Hindu organization, along with the relatives of the deceased, have gathered at the police station and protest after the murders. The victim's family members say that the throats of the deceased children were slipped by the accused, Sajid. The family members have said that the accused even drank blood of the victims after murdering them. There are places in the Hadith passages where Muslims can do some kind of, uh, uh, gosh, I just had the word right now, um, where they can eat another human being, especially against non-Muslims. But drinking blood, that's, that becomes so demonic. And you know what? If you look at it, the more you dive deep into Islam, if you're one of those that want to follow Islam, it, it turns you into this angry person. And I was so close to be like one of them. But I knew God had a hold in my life because it's like constantly I'm warring against my flesh and my soul. That's how evil the ideology is. You can't escape from it. You may try to make yourself think that Islam is true, but deep in your soul, God is always convicting you to get you waking up. You need to leave this religion. This religion is a problem into all humanity. It's a thorn to everyone. And I know not many of you are like that. I know they're just nominal Muslims living their life. And remember, I'm always going to be fair. Okay, It goes back to the human being, being in the image, being made in the image of God. Because God still instill in you about having compassion. But if you're one of those being quiet about it, you think that everyone's just coming to attack you. You think that with Palestine and Israel, oh, everybody's coming after Islam while the media ignores it. Because, you know, shame on you, media, because everything to you is numbers and likes. This is why you're losing the respect. This is what happens when you allow sin to enter. See, God watches all things. This is why the media has not gained the attention anymore. People go into independent, folks. Why are they trying to stop certain social media? Because people can pull up the cameras. They can see what's going on. It became a gift so that we can use this type of opportunity to bring the truth. And you people are trying to block from it. Shame on you. Because it's not going to stop us. As long the living God lives. You may get away. You may, you may win certain battles, but you haven't won the war. Liberals, commies, Islamists. Let's see. Well, so this looks like a, a video of it. Check it out. I'll put the post on it. You know, I'll put a post on it if you guys. It looked like a long 56 minutes video, but it looked like a serious situation. You know, this is why, to the I, I really want to emphasize this. There are a lot of Muslims that never looked in their book and they see the things in the news like I used to. And they wonder why they're picking, they think that we're picking on them. But unless you, you don't look into your sources. This is where it all derives from. Anyone that tells you that Islam was based on different Muhammad defended himself, he never defended himself. I promise you, Muslim scholars will tell you that everything was an offensive war. Like, you can't even say nothing. You can't even criticize Muhammad. That tells you how weak and sensitive you are. That's why Islam is the OG of all wokeism. All these wokeism infiltrated by them. When you allow, when you allow Islamists into your government, where do you think all this silencing comes from? It goes hand in hand with Nazism. See, the devil uses the same concept, creates different religion, and they want everybody to fight and kill each other. This is problem. This is the same time when I was growing up. They want to silence, silence you everything. You can't talk about this. You can't say this. Why do you think your whole emotions are building up like this for the truth? Now when it's told and they get angry, they try to stop you, silence you, or unalive you anyways. But that's not going to stop. The truth will be spread. That's why it's all from the devil. The devil is trying to stop you from telling the truth. The deceased children are 14-year-old Ayush and 6-year-old Honey. Javed also tried to slit the neck of the third child in the house. However, he somehow freed himself and ran away. Bunch of coward Islamists like they do. Like these Taliban. Our government is a big mess. I, I, I hate political correctness. Anyone that says that that we lost the war is because of political crime. We didn't technically didn't lose. If we wanted to, we could have bombed the crap out of it, took out half the population of these Islamists. It's a constant battle trying to do things what's right. 
all of a sudden the Taliban comes all, yeah, look, Allahu Akbar. Hiding like a bunch of little B-I-T-C-H. This is the world we live in. To the Europeans, to those that witness what the Ottomans did, especially to many of our Assyrians and Chaldean friends, they know what it's like under the Islamic Empire, what they've done to the people, almost trying to genocide them. This is their way of conversion, ladies and gentlemen. This is 2024. I don't have to repeat myself, show you the sources. You can, you can look it up in the YouTube. I, I have stuff posted on my channel with the sources with it. And I will do some more as a reminder because we really want to reach the, the, the liberals because if these people keep allowing it, they're like in the middle, it's going to be a big mess. You never forget the history when the Islamic Empire reached almost parts of Europe. And then they want to criticize about the Crusades or us defending. See, what Muhammad did was he did the offensive. Once he took control, then he wants to bring Allah. Oh, anyone that fights against Allah and Muhammad, they will come after you. All of a sudden, they want to use the defense mechanism. You don't expect people to defend themselves? There are things of righteous, righteous defending. Many atheists get it wrong. They act like, oh, they're all the same. All this religious war. Don't act like and pretend... That the atheism and communism never started wars, also too. That's why if you if you're serious about reading history, listen to Christianity, even within the Jewish and the Old Testament, never it says to go offensively and fight people they think differently. You could defend yourself. There's a difference about it when they're coming against a nation or a national security issue. That's the reason why laws are placed. You don't just let criminals get away. Like these Democrats and liberals try to do. This is the thing that mind boggles me. I don't know how they allow these bad guys to get away. It's like they like to please the bad guys. Disgusting people. The family members have said that Sajid even drank the... Oh, that is so disgusting. See, this... I don't know. Islam will do something so demonic. Take it to a whole nother level. And when I say Islam, I don't go against the people. But what the ideology behind it, if you allow it. Like and share, everybody... I got some more reports to share. Look, a lot of things been happening with these Islamists. And we're not going to let them get away. I'll talk to you guys soon. And God bless.